Serap Su Tinubu over failure to reverse petrol price calls for NNPCL probe. In the last few weeks, Nigerians have seen the cost of petrol rise from 700 naira to 1,000 naira and from 1,000 naira to 1,200 naira and in some cases 1,500 naira per litre depending on location. In view of the Social Economic Rights and Accountability Project, Serap has filed a suit against President Bola Ahmed Tinubu claiming that he failed to order Nigerian National Petroleum Commission Limited, NNPCL, to reverse the unlawful pump price of 845 naira to 600 naira. In the suit, it reads in part, the price of the product increased to 855 naira per litre from about 600 naira and in some instances above 900 naira per litre. The apparently unlawful increase in petrol price followed a scarcity caused by the reported refusal by suppliers to import petroleum products for the NNPCL over a 6 billion naira debt, Serap claimed in the suit. Serap has also fought Tinubu for refusing to probe cases of corruption and mismanagement of funds by the NNPCL. In the suit, it read, the NNPCL allegedly failed to remit $2.04 billion and 164 billion naira of oil revenues into the public treasury, as documented in the recently published 2020 annual report by the Auditor General of the Federation. The suit read in part, the suit which was filed on Friday, September 13th at the Federal High Court Abuja as as respondent, President Bola Ahmed Sinubu, the Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice, Mr. Latif Fagbemi San and the NNPC Health. Serap is pleading with the court to compel President Sinubu to direct the NNPCL to reverse the unjust, illegal, unconstitutional and unreasonable increase in the price of petrol from 845 Naira per litre to 600 Naira per litre. According to the suit, number by FHC slash ABJ slash CS slash 1361 slash 2024 filed by its lawyer Ebuoluwa Adegboruwa San. Serap stated that the increase in petrol price is causing immense hardship to those less well off as the economic situation in Nigeria deteriorates. The increase is pushing people further into poverty. However, the court is yet to fix a date for the airing of this suit.